Hi everyone, this is Aves from Automation Play. We have finally launched Industrial Automation Industry 4.0 and Double IoT Bootcamp. As you can see over here, Industry 4.0 and Double IoT Bootcamp consist of my all industrial automation courses, my IoT courses, <clears throat> my pure industrial IoT courses, courses related to cloud, to courses related to programming. So all of the courses related to industrial automation and industrial IoT are now included in this bootcamp. Earlier we had launched automation bootcamp, but it did not have few of the pure double IoT courses that are now being included. For example, Siemens industrial IoT course using Siemens TIA portal, MQTT and IoT cloud platform. So you can send that data directly from your S7 1200 PLCs or S7 1500 PLCs to the local MQTT broker or to the online IoT cloud platforms as well, right? And launching this beautiful course on PLC next, that is the pure double IoT PLC. We have courses on Python programming as well. It is popular for uh, SCADA scripting as well, like in Ignition, and it is becoming popular for PLCs as well. For example, you can program PLC next using Python as well. Then we have Influx DB and Grafana. If you are developing an on-premises cloud, on-premises local databases, you have option of MySQL or MariaDB as well, but those are not pure time series databases. Influx DB is a pure time series database. Time series data is the requirement of process automation, plant automation. That's why we use historians, but those are very expensive. So you can use Influx DB and Grafana is a dashboard. It is an excellent dashboard that you can display or, uh, or organize your data at. Then we are using Node-RED as well. Node-RED is become, become really popular for, it's a flow-based programming. It is a low-code, no-code language, and it is popular for, for example, you can program your Raspberry Pi devices or you can program industrial IoT devices using Node-RED as well. Then we have obviously Raspberry Pi as well. If your PLC does not have MQTT library, these PLCs have latest firmware versions for Siemens PLCs. For example, if you're using S7-1200, you need version four and above. And if you're using 1500, you need version two and above. But you, if you have legacy PLCs, you can easily use Raspberry Pi as a gateway device because it has Wi-Fi, it has MQTT, and it can send data to cloud as well. Then we have our uh, previous courses of SCADA and Siemens as well, because if you are, for example, using one PLC to send data to the cloud to remotely monitor via app, that is possible. But when you are reaching towards enterprise level double IoT solution strategy, you need SCADA. Then you send data to the cloud from your SCADA platform because that's where your all process or automation data coming over here. Now, if you have some separate PLCs data with separate uh, you know, uh, requirement to get data to the your enterprise cloud or online cloud, and you have SCADA as well. You can use MQTT for uh, establishing communication between all these devices, between uh, all these platforms, and then send send data to the cloud. So there there are lots of ways, lots of uh, strategies for double IoT industry 4.0. So I've covered all that. Then apart from MQTT, OPC is really popular uh, for um, uh, communication between uh, hardware and software, communication between devices as well, especially OPC UA. So I've covered OPC DA in these courses and OPC UA course is going to be included later on because I feel MQTT is becoming really popular first and foremost because you can send data to easily to the cloud as well like I have shown. Then there are C++ courses as well. Uh, we have LM Bradley course as well. So LM Bradley, Siemens, Delta all PLCs are <coughs> sorry covered in it. Apart from that, I have now uh, included uh, server uh, Delta server drive course as well. Some VFD courses on Siemens are going to be included in this uh, bootcamp as well. Then we have PCB design and IoT with ESP8266 included as well. So there are three to four courses I have planned in future for like Siemens VFD, Mitsubishi PLCs, uh, courses on AutoCAD ePlan. So right now I believe it's 18 plus courses. They, that would be go around 22, 23 courses uh, in few months. So enroll now, it is on special early bird price of $80. In $80 you get 18 courses which otherwise would cost you I believe uh, to $20 because these courses individually are of $20 so you can avail this uh, bootcamp you will have 
individual certification as well and you will have complete certification of industry 4.0 and double iot bootcamp once you complete all the courses and passes our assessment we are further including and upgrading all these courses from time to time you have my support as an instructor and i have two more instructors that you will have support from as well so if you have any query uh just one thing you can just click on buy now it will take you to the checkout page and you can pay through your debit or credit card easily you don't have to contact me myself or my team you can just simply pay and start learning so if you have any questions you can contact me you can email me you can uh whatsapp me as well every detail is mentioned in the description so yep thank you for watching this complete video i hope you enroll soon take care bye